Hi, I'm Muhammad Aziz bin Abdul Zaman and I am the project director. Hi everyone, I am Umar and I am a prototype designer. My name is Zikri Akamal bin Azhar. I am video editor for this project. Hi, I'm Muhammad Shafi Sharis. I'm the video editor too of this project. My name is Muhammad Hashem bin Hasbua and I work for script editor for our community project. Hi, my name is Muhammad Arif. I am an organizer of this project. Hi, my name is Muhammad Ayman. I am currently holding a position as a data analyst for our group project. It goes without saying that no person wants to be involved in a traffic accident. Unfortunately, it seems serious and fatal accidents are on the rise in Malaysia. Accidents not only affect those who are involved in the crash, but the shock and aftermath of a fatal or serious crash can affect families, friends, and entire communities. How it all started. The way we have interacted with over the year have always commented how car and bike cut in front of them on the road, not knowing the lorry driver are unable to see them due to the blind spot. There are many discussions among the driver on this topic. When an accident happens, lorry driver are always be blamed. So we have decided to champion this project called Future Road Savior. Project goals to minimize the road accidents by equipping the lorry with crash avoidance system to educate and raise awareness among road users to understand the blind spots on a lorry. Accident causes can be attributed to inattention and lack of risk awareness towards vehicle blind spots at traffic junctions. Blind spots are areas around a vehicle where other road users cannot be seen by the driver. These include areas around the front, back and sides of the vehicle. Heavy vehicles like trucks and buses have more blind spots due to their larger size and design. Blind spots impede the driver's vision of the road and they may not notice your presence while you are in their blind spots. In such situations, accidents are more prone to happen.
besides educating the community about blind spots, we also come up with an idea to equip the lorry driver with a crash avoidance system. This project idea is based on a sensor controller and to create this sensor, the things that we need are resistor, piezo buzzer, proximity sensor, transistor, and battery. And the next video will give you a very good understanding on how it works. This is a pollution avoidance system based on the sensor. This type of the system is the most rapidly increasing safety feature in the automotive industry. The system allows Nori to identify driver the chances of collision and give audio warning to driver, so that the driver can take necessary action to avoid it. Terima kasih lah kerana sudi berkongsi ini lah, ok? Ok, nama saya, nama saya Nur Azman bin Nordin. So, saya mula bertukar dengan gini-gini pada 1992. Ini ni memperbanyakkan operasi dan letters ni kita dalam, dalam, uh, dalam, dalam apa dalam uh, merangka satu sistem kita panggil wake emotion high speed wake emotion kita pasang uh, uh, melalui kerjasama antara Kementerian Pengangkutan dengan JKR kita akan pasang uh, uh, sensor yang boleh tangkap perak on the, uh, secara real time dan secara pagi kita akan kena pasang mana laluan-laluan utama so itu ya insentif kita untuk sekarang ni selain daripada enforcement secara manual lah. Bagus. Yeah. <laughs> Saya lepas panjang ni dia tak nampak kenderaan di sebelah kiri apa bila dia dah turn 40, 30%. Bila dia dah turn left and right 30%, dia punya blind spot dah habis. Sebab echo tu dah, dah berlipat. So dengan yang ada sensor ni, dia boleh memberi lah kenderaan dia daripada pelaku kepala ni. Dia tidak ada kemahiran. Dan setengah tu tidak tahu pun apa blind spot. Ini di bawah section 41 Akta Pengangkutan Jalan 1987. Uh, memandu Dengan cuai boleh menyebab, yang menyebabkan kematian. Nah, ha? Memandu cuai menyebabkan kematian. So untuk sekarang ni kemalangan ini uh, denda dia adalah minimum sepuluh ribu bagi kesalahan kamu. Mahal sekarang ni. Pada lori driver. Pada lori driver denda sepuluh ribu minimum maksimum dua puluh ribu bagi kesalahan kamu. Bagi kesalahan dan penjara boleh tidak melebihi dua tahun. Bagi kesalahan kedua, minimum dua puluh, maksimum kedua dan seterusnya. Minimum dua puluh, maksimum lima puluh. Memang parah. Dan boleh dipenjara tidak lebih daripada lima tahun. Uh, untuk soalan yang kedua ni Saya setuju lah juga Apabila orang cakap uh, Kemalangan lori ni lebih berbahaya daripada kemalangan kereta Sebab apa saya cakap macam tu Sebab Kemalangan lori ni uh, Yang seperti yang korang semua tahu Lori ni membawa muatan yang sangat berat Contoh macam saya ni Pernah membawa lori trailer yang bertantan Bila lori, lori ini memerlukan masa yang 
sangat yang cukup lama untuk break dan berat muatannya akan membuatkan kesan pelanggaran terhadap uh, kenderaan lain. Oleh itu, uh, apa yang saya boleh cakap, uh, kemalangan lori akan lebih teruk banding dengan kemalangan kenderaan yang lain. In conclusion, by having this sensor detector, it can give a lot of impacts to an accident rate in Malaysia. So I hope by making this video, more road users after this will be more aware about this blind spot. And I also hope that it can give more confidence level to the lorry driver when they are driving their own transport in order to create safety road environment in Malaysia.